Hello, I'm Norman Swan, and I'm here to chat to you about some of the changes that are taking place around your aged care home due to this new virus called COVID-19. You probably know all this, but COVID-19 is an illness that spreads very easily and often has symptoms similar to the flu. And like the flu, anyone can get this virus. But some people are more likely to become very sick if they have it, including older people or people who already have an ongoing medical condition. To make sure everyone stays healthy in your aged care home, they've had to make some changes to their usual way of doing things. They know this can be frustrating, but they want you to know that they're doing everything they can to work through this situation as quickly as possible while still keeping you safe. Your safety as a resident is the aged care home's biggest priority. So let's talk about some of the changes you might see around your facility in the coming weeks. You might notice that the staff are wearing new uniforms and equipment, like masks or robes, and you might even be asked to wear them too. These might look like what you would see in a hospital or during an operation. And they can seem strange, but they help protect you and everyone else in your home. You can always ask the staff about these items and they can explain why they're important. You might also find that you are moved or your friend or a fellow resident is moved to a different room. You might be also asked to spend more time in your room than normal and spend less time in common rooms. That's to avoid the risk of spreading the virus. Your meals might also be a bit different to usual. They may be delivered to your room and they might not be the same meals and drinks that you usually have. Your family and friends might not be able to visit you as often as they usually do or in the same way. Your family and friends might now have to make a booking with the facility before they visit and they might visit you by standing outside a window and speaking to you from the outside. They might also catch up with you by using technology such as a phone or an iPad instead of visiting you in person. This is also to avoid the risk of the virus spreading to your family and friends and also back to you and also prevent them spreading the virus if they happen to be carrying it because we don't want you to get sick. Even though there might be a lot of things changing, you still have the same rights as always and it's important that those rights are not forgotten. These changes can be difficult, hard to understand, but there is help available. You can always talk to the staff and ask them questions. Did you know that aged care advocates are also available to help you? The role of an aged care advocate is to work with you and your family to make sure your voice is heard and to make sure your rights are being maintained. They can help you in understanding your rights and getting additional supports during the COVID-19 pandemic. Aged care advocates are independent from aged care providers and government and work at your direction. The Older Persons Advocacy Network, or OPAN for short, is a national network of aged care advocates. If you're concerned about the changes in the facility or would like further support, you can call 1-800-700-600 or ask the staff to put you in contact with OPAN. A friendly staff member from OPAN will be able to help you with free, confidential advice. We know this can be a very challenging time and we thank you for your patience as the whole system in aged care works together to keep everyone healthy. We're in this together and we're all here to help.